so people were thinking about a nation, among others, thinking about what you could do. Thirty pages of, of text, say, you know, that, that someone could flick through on the on the bookstall and buy, uh, whether it be prose or or poetry or a bit of a mixture mixture of both. Novelty, currency, topicality, a little bit of scandal, perhaps you know, uh, a little bit something, a little bit salacious, perhaps that pushed the bounds of, of censorship. So a good way to build a regular readership was to create a sense of controversy through your writing. Emma Smith sees a parallel with social media platforms today. I mean, sometimes modern parallels seem a bit a bit cheap, but if you were to think about what drives traffic on social media, it's disagreement or it's extreme statements, it's things that people, it, it's arguments and it's, it's kind of showdowns. And I think that's true to some extent of the commercial press in, in the 1590s. 